And welcome back to Flexible Games, where we are playing Mashinki. And I know this isn't a massively watched series, but, uh, you know, it, it harkens me back to the ye good old days of, uh, like, Transport Tycoon. It's, uh, it's, kind of a, it's kind of a fun game. It's simple, and that's, that's a breath of fresh air after playing some of the games that I've covered lately. Like, uh, yeah... Having something simple to, to do kind of, is kind of nice. Okay, so we want to sort of slink in between these two. We want to come down and get right in there. Okay. God, I'm, I'm keeping an eye on my iron down here. This that's could easily become a problem. Okay, well, let's get another line going here actually you know what I could do to save on resources this this double track this okay oh come on all right, now this can come, oh, no, come on, out. All right, now we want this one to go this way. Get that double tracked. We want this one to come down. Now, here's what we could do. Go down and meet up right here. And then this one has to come down and up like that. Now, oh, see, I don't want to. If you can't figure out what I'm doing already. Okay, so you come in like that. And this one has to come up. Like that. So now we at least share a couple tracks in there. So you and you and you and you and you. There we go. Everybody is got a direction and you come down here like that. Okay, now you can probably put these signals a little closer together since there'll probably be a, quite a few trains on this system. Okay, and so you go in, you come out, and then Oh, I need to do that. There we go. So this is gated going in, and that way that signal changed between these two. Coming out, um, Yeah, that's a problem. I might I might just have to double double these up. Like that. Uh, I might have to do that. But what we can do is uh share a signal box or a a, a depot. Extensions you think it's already electrified I think it's, it's really hard to tell whether or not the depot is electrified it really is uh, okay so that takes care of quite a lot of oil now we're gonna need power there's a there's a coal power plants plant right here there's a coal mine right there how Fortuitous. There's another coal mine right there. There's just all of the coal mines. So we're going to move some mountains. Like all the mountains. I just don't, don't want mountains interfering with my project here. Uh, all right. It's a whole lot of land that has to sort of get reclaimed. Um, 
Because I want to power all this system, obviously. Let's first extensions, additional oil wells, desalinization plant. I don't know why you need that on an oil farm, but uh, it is what it is. Additional oil wells here and here. All okay. That's all of the all of the oil there. Extensions, additional oil wells. Here, 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 here. Okay, so all of the oil coming in now, huge amounts. And finally, the uh, signals to go to the individual stations. Uh, I mean, we might have more than two trains on here. Probably, I mean, it depends on what our throughput has to be. But we may even tie this into this other refinery. Who knows? Who knows what we're going to need? Um, all right. So we want an engine. So the loc. Um... Kind of torn between the Loke and the Aries. Definitely don't want one that requires oil or two oil for that matter. So yeah, let's go with the Loke. I mean, the Aries would be even better. It's more powerful, higher speed, exact same cost for fuel. So I don't know why I haven't been using this. So let's go Aries. Fun times. Wagons. Oil, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so we want orders. Let's do the top one first. You to you start. Are you, are you, do you need, do you need this? There you go. Uh, all right, so we want to duplicate this train, but have different orders. So we want to go to the bottom one now and here and start on you. Okay, now that those are taken care of, we need to start delivering the actual oil products themselves. We have quite a lot uh, of upgrades on this. I'm not really sure what the what the storage is. It's weird; it doesn't like give me a storage total, but it's it's a lot. Um, all right. We have two other oil wells here, and we want to find some extensions. Oh, look at that. This one needs more oil. Eek. Okay. Now for the factory. So what I want to do is sort of sneakily get a station or two up here <clears throat> we can come in and and stick that stuff right in there come in right in right in on top because I want to put a road in between these two and deliver goods via road vehicles you know we don't really use road vehicles very much in uh, in this world so I kind of wanted to get that up and running so you no, I don't want a restaurant. I want the extra catchment area, storage building. Uh, signal box and a warehouse. It's all of the upgrades right there. 
So, station. Like so. And if we put a road between the two. Like so. We can do a station right here. And that is part of this station, which is awesome. So I want to, oh, come on. There we go. Put a little pass through there. There's tr trucks coming in here. Well, I can set up the I can set up the route to be a little bit more friendly with these. Uh, still no idea when I I might have to pause it. Like there's only one house right here. That's it. We're not going to get a whole lot of passengers in between there. Not a lot. Hey, look at that. Our first oil is coming in. So let's uh, let's get busy with this. We're going to want... Yeah, this is going to be sort of a tight corner here. So let's get... Let's get this going. Uh, we're going to have you come down a little bit. Well, I want you to come out a little bit and then down like so. right past that city no look at that beautiful it's almost exactly the same square coming down but almost yeah it might even be the exact same square or off by one it looks like it's the same one. Could be wrong. Um, obviously, we probably want to double that. It's kind of a needless expense. I could just create little pass-throughs. But I've played enough of these games where I always regret not double-tracking stuff. Always. It's expensive to do... But I always regret not doing it. Okay. That might be a little... Eh, if it works, it works. That's fine by me. Alright. Now a... Uh, yeah, we're going to need another depot. This depot is a little too far away. Or we could just bulldoze all of this and add in, you know, a, a longer extension for depots. And then maybe in this one. Let's tie all these together. Something like that. Now they're all one. All right, extensions. And then signals. There we go. Obviously, I didn't need that long of a stretch, but it looks more industrial that way, I think. All right, so another engine. check our values here i think we're doing pretty good wagons oil this time one two three four five six eight nine ten eleven perfect orders here up to here he's highlighting the right station and I think we should, I think we should start this guy off. That red indicates, yes, the train is indeed moving. 
Now we need to think about power. Um, so this guy here needs to be upgraded. We don't nearly have any, we really don't have any uh, tokens yet. <clears throat> Did I not extend this? One, two, three, four. I didn't. I didn't actually extend this yet. Good Lord. How did I forget about that? Uh, well, I'm glad now. I'm really glad I made this longer than it needs to be. Now let's pause. Uh, you, 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 station, and compass. I do like writing over track with stations. It's a very helpful feature. You, you, and you. There. Like the mistake never happened. All right, now power. Obviously, coal power plant, coal mine. It's a match made in heaven. Let's get you, you, um, extensions, freight, waiting room, storage building, signal box, warehouse. Expensive little set of upgrades to be able to build out another two of those. And have, you know, it's going to be a lot of storage. All of that combined is a lot of storage. If we look over here, you can see 1,500 storage with all those. Finally, we're finally able to see how much storage we have. So 1,500 is a lot. It's a glorious amount. Um, let's see power station. We also have to, we also have to work on the goods here. Uh, and the factory extension, uh, the dye plant is one we're going to want. There we go. Now we're, now we're starting to make that. Um, let's over here, extensions. I want to put the signal box first, warehouse, uh, freight station. And uh, we don't really no uh, waiting room. Why not? Why not? Capacity plus five hundred. I mean, it's it is what it is. Uh, something like that. Get an extra two out of there. Coal storage. Maintenance shed. You can worry about that later. Second head frame. Third head frame. How about that? All of the coal. Just all of it. It's a quick it's a quick run. I don't think we'll need more than one train on it. Like so. And let's go here. Depot. I'm so used to putting those little locomotive works. I don't even know if that does anything anymore. Um, all right, so we want a train to deliver to this little guy here. So you, engines. Let's see. E118. I mean, yeah, see, look at that. It, it's like power token, power token. The only difference between these two, and it's not fuel, it's just raw power. So why would you ever not use the Ares? Like, it's the same cost. I mean, yeah, it's a little, it's steel instead of iron and power, but why would you ever not use this thing? Wagons, coal, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, ha ha, 13, 195 coal, beautiful, 
orders. We definitely won't need another one of these. Deliver to there. Start. Power. You. Power to there. Power to there. Just stretch it all the way down. Skim these two buildings. We don't we don't need to deliver power to them. Do need to deliver power to this guy here. And then over to these two here. So let's try to merge these into one. Like so. And as soon as he gets the first load of coal, um, there's some more power tokens. Are we are we doing anything yet? Where's the where's the train? You're still in here? Seriously, what is going on? Why are trains not like I'm not paused? Come on now. There you go. That's weird that they like absolutely have to have to have a signal before they will like ever work right. It's weird. Oh, I hit one again. Bingo! Power! Woo! And now we're, we're earning a little bit more of the tokens. Let's turn all of these off. Um, here, 251. Ooh. Vehicle fuel, 304. That's a problem. We're in... in an effort to fix our oil discrepancy we are running out of power tokens well that's a problem go back to the steam age when it was a little easier but this should be giving me a bit more power tokens here okay so this guy should be showing no this this guy there we go showing me that he's powered uh this guy should be showing me he's powered excellent and this little guy powered so i don't have any of that how are we doing on our oil supply see yeah we're we're doing really good on our oil supply Okay, now for trucks. We need to deliver the goods that we're getting out of here and deliver them to the cities. So I'm gonna pause it and we are gonna do a station right in town. 
and right in town. Station is not going to accept passengers. Station is not going to accept passengers. So we'll produce mail only. No passengers, no passengers. I don't want to move passengers at all. They can walk. Okay. So all goods can go in between the two. So let's get these done real quick. Vehicles, goods. Okay. So we want the orders to be go to here, go to here, go to here, go to here. So it'll pick up goods, drop them off here. Pick up goods, drop them off here, and repeat. Pick up goods, drop, and, and so on and so forth. It'll, it'll be good. It'll work out. Um, so we want possibly to create loops. I don't know if they'll be used. They probably won't be. But, you know, it is what it is. Um, let's just... Man, that's just easier to do it that way, right there. Drop them off here. If they, you know, if the AI is halfway decent, they should, this should work out. Oh, it's paused still. Let's, uh, let's duplicate you. Start. Only eight goods can be moved. <clears throat> Heavy hauling mod, this is not. How many goods do I have? I have, I have a decent amount of goods. And now you're going to go that way. Well, whatever. You know, it. You just, you just do what you want. I think it's based on where, you know, what they use and stuff like that. So let's go you. I'm trying to space these out a little bit trying not exactly successful so let's get this next one out all right so these should fill up relatively fast um i would like to expandify the station a little bit If I can see what extensions are on here. Hey, look at that. We have waiting rooms. We have other things and stuff. And let's go over here and see if we can expand this guy. Um, station. You, you. I want to. Why don't you limit? Hey, are we, there we go. Bingo. Now we can do we can do mail, uh, vehicles, mail. Twelve mail at a time. Orders. Here. To here. <clears throat> Duplicate. You. Orders are the same, yes. Start on, start on through. Um, they shouldn't really generate that much mail, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna space these guys out pretty far. So you can pick up your 12 mail, and once he's on his way, past the halfway point, I'm gonna start this guy. There we go. All right, we are we are delivering things, and the city has already grown one. Look at that, we got another house over here. Um, good times. Let's get an extension on here. I want a waiting room right away. 
just in case. Yeah, let's do a waiting room over here. Freight station. Uh, signal box. Over here. Warehouse. Nah, we don't need a warehouse. We don't. Uh, I don't really think we're gonna get that much stuff, but you never know. This city has uh, grown a little bit too. It looks like it had a little stub of a road here. Let's connect that up to the main city here. Uh, I don't know if this is upgraded yet. Oh, look how slow they're going. Oh, that's so painful. Oh, man. Crazy. Okay, now... How are we doing on our on our income here? Um, we are... Using all of our fuel still. All of our oil. Looks like we have a net gain so far in, in power. Uh, power tokens. So having this power station up and running and and running full blast is um, is helping our income of power tokens. So I don't have to worry about that. Um, but it seems we are getting we are using like all of the tokens that we have available. How is our oil build up down here? We're not really building up a whole lot. I really would want to build this. But I can't. Um, unfortunately, I, I was hoping that this extra system would uh, would give us some good token income. I would. I mean, look at that. That would be that would be five tokens every twenty seconds. That would be huge. But. I need the tokens in order to run the tokens. It's crazy. I have too many fuel-based or uh, oil-based trains out there. Should have been paying attention to that a little closer. These oil wells are bursting at the seams. Um, and this thing is has got plenty of oil until I upgrade it. Which I'm not anticipating being able to do. No tokens for I just set up a whole new system. How are there no tokens? Like this factory spitting out five tokens every 10 seconds. And you're telling me that's not enough? No, nope, now this is going up. See, one of the things that really kills is when this slowdown happens to a train that's actually delivering oil. That is devastating. I don't know if there's any more efficiencies that I can squeeze out of any of these systems. Like this has got plenty of oil. How are we doing down here? Yeah, look at the amount of oil down here. So I think I'm going to have to be dramatic. Oh, we have one token. Is that one extra token? And then it disappears. Um, so last year, 17, yeah, 1744, 1744, 1996, 1996, like, and we have plus 368 minus 318, so that's good. We're almost done with 1998. Almost. It is still crazy how many oil tokens we're going through. This is nuts. 
Coal tokens were almost out of. How is that possible? That one sneak up on me? Indeed it did. Look at that. What's using coal? I bet you I still have some like... Yeah, I still have... <laughs> It's almost the year 2000. I've got I've got tons and tons of trains out here. Let's just go to the depot. I don't even want to deal with you right now. It's a, it wasn't a it wasn't a, a coal train. There's an oil train that I could probably get rid of. Um, here's another train. Uh, it's a money train, but look at the size of that city. Cities have just grown and grown and grown. Okay. You're done. Go to depot. Okay, this guy. Um, can I just sell all of him? Engines. Now, we want to avoid oil I guess money is the only one that we have available as an alternate. Put the locomotive works on there. Engines. There we go. There's some more. Oh, Lord. That really does not help matters at all. SGV manufacturer. Start production, finish a prototype, test a prototype on the track, switch to mass production. Yeah, that's not in our cards right now. We are out of coal tokens. Where are we using coal tokens? We are using a lot of trains with coal tokens, apparently, out there. Uh, engines. I would like... Uh, I guess the bangle is going to have to do it. It's bangalicious. Uh, man, that is brutal. Like, really? Um, I, sh I should have just left this train. I mean, it was using two, and it's almost exactly the same stats. A little bit more horsepower with the bango, but still, that's just brutal. Uh, wagons, uh, wood. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, these systems haven't been touched in a very, very long time. Um, so orders here. To, I'm guessing, here. And let's put in a... Signal. Don't really need the high speed train or high speed track, but it is what it is. This poor guy. Um, info. So he can he can hold fifty five, which and this is forty nine. So whatever. Let's try to track down some trains. There's another oil using train. Track down the trains that are. Oh lord, look at that. <laughs> People on that train are like, we could be walking faster than this. Um, where are my trains that are using coal? This is insane. Um, this is a problem I don't think I can solve. Not with the severe lack of views and interest in the game. So I'm, I might, uh, yeah, I'm going to be moving on. 
probably going to start a season two in another brick in the mall. Uh, that game has recently gone to 1.0. And it has a ton of different content, changes, updates, fixes, and challenges um, from the last time when I when I, you know, debuted it on this on the channel. So, lots of stuff to check out on that. Even mods that we could add eventually. So yeah, I uh, I have covered this game in its entirety. I think um, even went back to it after the new era came out, and I am at a loss for how to mitigate these problems. This is not not a nice uh, layout here. Not being able to build my own industries is kind of a crutch. Um, like even if it was limited to the natural resources are you know set and then your factories you can place anywhere because that's kind of how the real world works. You don't just build a factory in Nebraska because there's oil wells in Ohio like it just doesn't work like that um, all right so thank you everybody for watching even though this was short and sweet um, and uh, hopefully see you in another brick in the mall so I will see you next time